I am going to show you unbelievable video from Fox News yesterday. This is this is unbelievable stuff. During a Fox News interview yesterday, Fox host Brian Kilmeade tried to push the conspiracy theory that Joe Biden pushed for the firing of Ukrainian prosecutor Viktor Shokin because it would be good for Hunter Biden and Hunter Biden's wallet. And as a result, Joe Biden's wallet. This is a big part of the conspiracy around the Biden crimes. And it goes like this. Joe Biden by himself decided Viktor Shokin is investigating Burisma. That's bad for Hunter and it's bad for me. So I'm going to go over there and try to get Viktor Shokin fired. Of course, the truth is Shokin was rampantly corrupt. It was the official policy of the Obama administration to want him fired. And it was also the opinion of many of our allies that Viktor Shokin was a corrupt problem and should be fired. This is unbelievable. Brian Kilmeade is interviewing the former president of Ukraine, uh, Petro Poroshenko, and he tries to get Poroshenko to help the conspiracy theory. And Poroshenko destroys it and goes, no, Shokin was a crazy person. There was something wrong with him and he was supposed he should have been fired. And Kilmeade looks furious, furious. This is golden video. Take a look at this. I had a chance to talk to uh, Victor Shokin, a man who says uh, he was uh, friends of yours, who you asked uh, to come back and help out during the transition uh, after the previous regime. Here's what he said on why he was fired by you. Listen. Poroshenko fired me at the insistence of the then Vice President Biden because I was investigating Burisma. There were no complaints whatsoever, no problems with how I was performing at uh, my job, but because pressure was repeatedly put on President Poroshenko, that is uh, what ended up in uh, him firing me. Is that why he got fired? Because of the billion dollars and the, the, the former Vice President, now President? First of all, this is the completely crazy person. Um, this is something wrong with him. Second, there is no one single word of truth. And third, I hate the idea to, com to make any comments and to make an, any intervention in the American election. We have very much enjoyed the bipartisan support. The look on Kilmeade's face is just golden. I've got to frame this. And uh, please do not use the such person like Shirk Shokin to undermine the trust between bipartisan support and Ukraine. Right. Uh, what do you mean? He's not your friend? I don't see him maybe four years or something at all and hate the idea to have him because he play very dirty game, unfortunately. Uh -oh. Okay, so that is not true. You didn't, you, he didn't get fired because of Joe Biden. He was fired be, uh, but because of his own statement. And if he do not do that, next day Ukrainian parliament will fire him uh, with that. All right, uh, Mr. President, thanks so much. <laughs> This is one of the main things. OK, this is one of the main stories about Biden. Biden had a personal vendetta to get rid of a guy who was doing nothing wrong because he was investigating Burisma and Hunter was on the board of Burisma and he was getting paid. And Biden was also probably getting paid. The reality is it was Obama policy in conjunction with allies, as confirmed here by the former Ukrainian president. This guy was a problem. This guy was corrupt. This guy was not was nuts. There was something wrong with him. And by the way, he was going to be fired anyway. Let's put up this picture of Brian Kilmeade's expression as this was taking place. This is what it looks like when your conspiracy theory implodes on national television. You hate to see it. Who am I kidding? You love to see it. That is an iconic moment from Fox News. It should be put in a time capsule so that in the future we can uh, uh, show folks the degree to which these bogus conspiracy conspiracy theories are actually debunked when people who know something about them are actually asked about it. Our sponsor, Sane Smart, has everything you need for doing your own engravings and 3D printing at home 
from CNC machines, laser engraving machines, FDM 3D printers, resin 3D printers. Sane Smart really has you covered and they are ready to answer your questions. Truly unparalleled customer service. Sane Smart is super beginner friendly. Trust me, I don't know anything about this stuff. Sane Smart sent me their newest machine. It's their Genmisu 3030 Prover Max, which is a desktop CNC router. Basically, it carves different types of materials from metal to wood with extreme precision. This thing is awesome, super easy to set up and just jump right into engraving. The machine is dependable. I love it. I used it to make these metal and wood engravings of our logo, which just look amazing. Getting into CNC engraving or laser engraving, 3D printing. This is an awesome hobby. The machines are small and can go in your garage or on a table somewhere. You can make really cool, unique gifts for friends and family, and it's just fun. That's the bottom line. You'll get 10 percent off almost all products when you go to davidpackmancom slash engrave and use the code Pacman. The link is down below.